next crazy moment took place all the way in round 10. Jake was piloting Branded versus Julian, who was piloting Punk Agents. Julian had access codes effect to Pop Guardian Chimera, and then on resolution, a Luber's effect activated in the graveyard. He brings back a Luber and calls the incorrect monster to negate in Master Flare Hyperion, when access code was indeed the better pick. He quickly tries to take it back and change the pick to access code, He's to which Julian stops given that he already picked Master Flare Hyperion. Upset at the situation, Jake says, and I repeat, if that's how you want to get your top, that's how we're going to do it. Twitch chat responded as you would imagine. Given that regardless, Jake would be winning that game, Julian did concede <laughs> and they went to a game three. The you know the funniest thing, chat? The funny, the funny, the funniest thing. That's how thing you want to get your top. That's this? how we're going right, to do on, it. On, Twitch chat responded as you would imagine. Right. Given that regardless. Is that you can just see... You can see the smile on his face, <laughs> even through the mask. Even though he has a mask chat, you can just see the smile on his face. He was toxic, tried to like saw cheat, never punish boys. So Jake would you can be see winning the smile that game. His, Julian did concede mask. and they went to a game three. The last game started with only four minutes and 30 seconds on the clock. And even though Jake gets to go first, his deck relies on punk cards, which would bring his life points lower than his opponents and result in a loss in time. Julian began his turn with a punk effect, which like I said, does bring your life points lower than your opponents, meaning that if Jake were to stall- Quick question. Um, I don't know. Escape, there we go. And I guess this could technically come up if I play, you know, regionals and stuff. Not for me. If you're playing chat and you have less than three minutes, do you activate a punk card? Like, isn't that just a misplay? Because I feel like it is. Because, I mean, I would never stall someone, but, like, I don't know what these punk cards do. So, like, in the remote, I'm going to be like, yo, can you read that card? What does it do? How does it work? Like, I don't know what these cards do. I just know one of them pays 600 to, like, Rotor or something like that. No, you yeah, I, I feel like you just don't do it because your opponent like you 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 don't have a way to win, right? In that turn, unless punk has like a burn card or they have like life point gain. Um, but that's a, that's an old thing from 5D's chat. It's like psychic used to be associated with life point cost. So I feel like if you're playing punk and you go into time, like I feel like you just don't activate the effect. And if that means you can't combo, like hey, you just don't combo then. Time rules or what's it called? You burn yourself out of time. I mean, I don't know what you like. I don't know if this deck can function without using one of those effects. But like, maybe you just go second, chat. Like, I don't know. Oh, he would auto win. Like, if I had like four minutes and I was playing, and I'm playing Eldritch chat, I'm going second. Because there's no way for like Eldritch to burn. Well, I technically goosed off. Ah, uh, actually, you know, hold on. It's like, wow, it's highly unlikely but yeah, you know what? Eldritch can win in time. If I open with like Castle and like Lord of the Heavenly Prison, I could set Castle, flip it over, summon Lord from my hand, search out Golden Lord. Ooh, it'd be so risky because I'd have to pay 800 life points, chat, to like, if, well, if I had Golden Lord in my hand, then, it, then it's just nuts. But um, I'd have to pay 800. So like, if the, if the, if the play gets stopped, then I lose. I don't even get the draw, it, but I have to like go for game. I'd have to like go for Gustav Max. You can't Gustav Max turn one. Yeah, you can. I just I just explained why you, how you can. It's 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 like highly unlikely, but you have to have Heavenly Lord. Um, and again, you have to have something. You have to have something to set that you can still use. So it could technically be Pot of Prosperity too. There's not a lot of spells in Eldritch that you can just activate that don't lock you into Zombie. So like Castle and Prosperity are the only ones I can think of. Can't do it with extravagance because it has to be the first thing. You cannot. Heavenly is a heart. Oh my god, you guys are so dumb. You don't activate the... Per oh my god. Um, you can use the special... Exactly. They're so dumb. You guys are You guys are actually Popega. You don't use the... You do not use the reveal effect, <laughs> chat. You just activate the effect the special summon. When a, when a set card is activated, you can special summon Heavenly Lore from your hand. That's the effect you're using. You're not going to use the reveal effect... Because why? Yeah, so you're just using Lord to put him on field, and then you try to summon Golden Lord. And at no point are you locked into zombies, and then you make what's it called. So there you go. The card is busted. That barely changes the that like barely changes the card. It almost never the only time that ever comes up is if you're going like second and your opponent activates something and you really just need to do damage. 
Like, yeah, you can technically just summon Lord without revealing him. He doesn't need to be revealed to, to summon, Chad. Y'all didn't know that? Julian tried to perform his combo, however, Anyways. kept being interrupted by Jake reading certain card effects and thinking excessively, leading many to believe he was just trying to stall for time. During Julian's turn, he said, proceed to N activate Chaos Ruler. Jake responded with, um, you said proceed to N, no, I'm just kidding, I'm not going to do that the know. way you what did me, watching? which will probably go down in the books Big as one of the worst up. PR plays of all up. time. Twitch chat was starting to get super upset that someone like Jake was going to win while acting the way that he acted. With one minute and eight seconds left in the round, turn gets passed to Jake. To start his turn, he activates Dark Ruler no more, to which the commenters say, and this was my favorite part, they say. So, Dark Ruler is very interesting. We're taking a look <laughs> at Jake's deck list, and he doesn't play Dark Ruler no more. The game was paused, and Twitch chat goes absolutely bonkers, <laughs> excited to see a potential game loss on the end of Jake. As people were celebrating, launching balloons, eating cake, pouring drinks, the awesome commentator cake. booth follows up by saying, Oh, we have the old deck list. He actually does run Dark Ruler. As you can imagine, saying that everyone was disappointed would be quite the understatement. 